<laughs> um, um, um. Ah! What is up, people of the internet? Mr. Dragon Rider 2012 here, aka Zydex here. And I'm enjoying some crap from Taco Bell. Let me tell you right now. Taco Bell is probably like Derp Central. The people there, I mean, took about like 10 minutes to get my order right. Then it probably also doesn't help the fact that uh, I don't go there that often. I wonder why. Okay, so we know that the 07 servers are up right about now. Are they really all that great? I can't really say for sure. Um, I am seeing, like, right now, if we look, uh, doo -doo 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 -doo, there's about 111k people on about now. Now, people said that, like, back in the glory days, um, that we would have, like, 200 or 300k about, at, I mean, and that was a good number, and that was during the week, and... But the thing is, once again, people don't really seem to realize that is when the game was infested with bots. Um, so that really, um, that really kind of blew things out of proportion. Um, so, I mean, I would think, you know, people are coming back a bit, and um, I guess really, um, bots are also coming back into the 07 game as well. And, I, I mean, I'm not kidding, I actually saw somebody uh, pretty much accuse people that like the EOC coming into 07 and botting in that game. Does that make sense? That's going to be like some five-year-old th uh, throwing that thread out in the forums. I'm, not, I'm kidding, that's just pathetic. I mean, that pr kind of proves a little bit, you know, how far some of these nostalgia freaks would go just to say EOC is bad, that's what's ruining the game. We need our back game, our our game back, gosh dang, but I mean, the, I mean, it, it's it's sad to see how people uh, are just completely that self-absorbed, they need to think that the way they need to, or the, they, the way they want to play the game is the way that it needs to be played. So also, uh, I pretty much looked at the vote here for the, uh, the, what was it, the vote for the old school servers. Right about now, it is currently at, I think, not even at two or a little about above 200k. Uh, no, I take that back, just just under 400k. Um, if this trend, I mean, it probably it probably will not hit 500k. Um, I did not want it to hit 250k. Uh, I wanted, you know, I mean, I knew they were coming back because uh, before I had a chance to even uh, state my opinion. As far as, I, di I didn't even want to see any votes come back for this. I mean, geez, people, I mean, grow up. I mean, get past your nostalgia here. But if that's what's going to get people to come back to the game, oh, well. Then, like, Jagex, you know, make money off of this and whatnot. Um, currently, uh, I mean, well, I'm going to refresh this real quick. As I get the lettuce out of my teeth. Um, we're at 300, 900, or 393,969. And wow, a lot of a lot of numbers divisible by three there, <laughs> and uh, so that's where it's at right about now. I mean, I really don't see it hitting uh, 500k within or within the next three days. I highly doubt that's going to happen because they have till the end of March. I think it was the end of March first, which actually that's going to kind of creep up pretty quick here. So, so yeah, I mean, I, it, it appears as if the vote will say that uh, everybody will be paying five dollars on top of their added membership already so and as far as news goes destiny this is a new game that is going to be developed by bungie and it seems like it is pretty good don't know exactly what it is right now um i've heard some speculations it's going to be a fps obviously you see guns in it uh, i've seen some people say it's going to be an rf yeah, I've seen some people say it's going to be an MMO, a real-time strategy. I, I don't know. It lo it definitely looks like it's going to be something a lot different than what Halo is. Obviously being made by Bungie, but... Um, I mean, it, it is something that it, I'm definitely look looking forward to, compared, uh, uh, especially with a lot of other people. Um, I'd actually like to see this. I'd actually like to play it. I'm, it looks very interesting. It's definitely... A de it's, Definitely a uh, way to mix up uh, the kind of kind of the gameplay as far as you know as all of us you have gotten used to Halo and stuff like that, especially well, from kind of being a recipient from Bungie and what they've given to us. Um, 
I mean, also, what I've also heard the speculation is that there's also, I mean, kind of, it, it will work in real time. Um, that would be something that would be cool. I mean, I would like to work with a game that works in real time that's kind of a bit of strategy, and it's maybe a little bit of shooter here and there, and a, quite a bit of leveling up. I mean, I, I do like, I like, I like the RP, I like the RPG, I like the FPS, I mean, there are RPG FPS, that's Borderlands. Now, if we could have something that kind of works in real time, so you could have, you know, you could kind of coordinate, you know, attacks and whatnot, you know, <clears throat> instead of having just, okay, here's one game, now let's, and then once we finish that, we go on to another, that's not, that doesn't really, that feels more of kind of like a sp sport, really, I kind of want something that kind of makes you feel like you're actually in the game, I mean, if that's what Destiny will um, uh, provide for all of us in the future, that will be really great. So yeah, if you guys like this video, leave a like in the like box, leave a comment if you like, and be sure to follow me on Facebook and Twitter, and if you subscribe, mmm, I'm just going to keep on enjoying my Taco Bell here. So yeah, thank you guys for watching, and may God bless you all. See you all later.